Hi everyone, welcome back to Howtex. Uh, today we have the iPhone 7 Plus and we're going to show you how to change the ringtones and notification sounds. Uh, so you want to go to settings, which is the gear shaped app, and then go into from the settings, you want to go down to sound and haptics uh, and click that. And now you have a number of options here. You can have uh, the phone vibrate while it's ringing, have it vibrate only when it's on silent. Uh, you can adjust the volume of the uh, ringers and alerts, uh, and then you can actually select the ringtones. So there's the main ringtone, which is, you know, basically when your phone is ringing, when you're getting a phone call, um, and you can just click on this, and you can select from the defaults, and then also any that you've loaded. I've loaded a bunch in here. Um, you can check out our other video for how to make a custom ringtone on an iOS device. You have to use uh, iTunes basically to load a special format in, but uh, it's not actually that tricky once you figure out how to do it. But basically for the built-in ones, you can uh, just select one. And in this case, the phone is actually uh, vibrating as well, um, in addition to the sound, because I have the vibration turned on. And you can do a number of different types of vibration here, um, besides just uh, besides just doing a sound. So uh, that's the ringtone itself. You can also do the text tone, voicemail tone, uh, the sound when you get an email, uh, when you send a mail, when you send a tweet, uh, Facebook, etc., etc. So it's actually quite a lot of different sounds. Um, and then you can also select whether you want uh, key clicks uh, or the locking sound to turn on and off. Um, and so it's actually pretty cool. Uh, they give you a lot more options than they previously did on the older versions of iOS, so you can really have a lot of fun with it. So that's the basics on how you change the ringtone and alert tones on the iPhone 7 Plus, and pretty much the same for all iOS 10 devices. If you have any questions, please leave a comment. Don't forget to subscribe, and please check out our other how-to videos for the iPhone 7 Plus and many other popular smart devices. Thanks. Bye. Um, but the steps are the same for both phones, so don't worry if yours is a little bit different than this one. Uh, basically, what you want to do first to remove the SIM, SIM card is...